In this discussion, you will get information about one of the useful ORM method, name is default underscore get. If you missed previous discussion about name underscore create method, please check link is available in description. Uh, I will show you two options as how it's work in GUI side and backend side. Let's go to first frontend side. Here I am going to student profile and try to create one new record. You can see here total 16 records is available. But let me create a new one. If I click to create button, you can see here this name field and this total fees having a default value like the name is Sunny Leon and the total fees is 1900. This is coming from the default code attribute. So this is how like default underscore get method is work. So this is called like default values here you can see and it works in two ways. Let me show you how it's work in backend side. I'm going to editor going to module and open to student profile let me close this one okay and you can see here this name field like using this default attribute in field level it will automatically called in default underscore get method then after you can see here this is a total fees yeah the student fees this default 1900 either you can use this default attribute in field level or you can override default underscore get method and add over there like default values based on your requirement let me show you how we will do it if you don't know about this default attribute let me give you one more example let's say this total fees don't have anything if i'm going to in front end side you can see like total fees is right now zero like while creating any new record so that time like a default value should be like this but after all like after depend on the user they can change also so i'm using like default equal to and then i'm giving here like some values like 20 and i'm going to in terminal i have to restart the service because i changed in python and uh, no need to upgrade the module only restart the service that's it discard this one and try to click to this create button so you can see this default value is coming from default attribute so right now what we did is we add uh, like we used field level default attribute let me show you how it's work in method level so I'm going to editor and simply I'm using here that method name and that method name is default underscore get and here we have to pass as a field list default this default uh, like uh, this field parameter having a list of string uh, values and uh, inside inside this field list having a field a field name only like this one currency id student fees name school underscore id and all here we have to use as a, we have to call super method so right now i'm just using that super method copy this class name then after self then dot default underscore get and here what we have to do is field underscore list we have to pass and here we have to simple return the like super call and uh, we have to add one more parameter here is api dot model so you have to remember one thing is default underscore get method is the method name odoo's default orm method like decorator is using api.model and this field having only one parameter field underscore list which having a list value list of string and uh, this field underscore list contains only the models field name and written type is a dictionary like 
dictionary let me show you one example print and i'm just print here the field list field underscore list and here i'm using the written statement rtm that's it and going to terminal and restart the service no need to upgrade the module going to front end side and refresh the patch okay you can see it's already called like this sunny leone and after the fees and total fees going to again in pycharm and open the terminal you can see here this field list and the return statement you can see here like name this one then after student fees total fees and active equal to true because here you can see this active field having also default attribute if you don't use any default attribute then uh, the return in while returning the statement you won't be visible any any field name you can see like oh, hobby list school address is passed in parameter but it didn't return here because they don't have the default values but yes one more thing is let me give you one more example like i'm just removing this default statement from here and uh, the same one and this one also after I am just restarting the service and go to the browser and again refresh the page and now you can see the all the default value won't be visible here so it's blank right now because we did we removed the default attribute in field devil but we can also override in default underscore get method like how like let me show you one example you have to use here like rtm then after active equal to true and rtm then after the name field here i'm using like sunny leon again like the total fees you can see here like total underscore fees i'm using like four thousand something like that and i'm restart the service uh, but before the restart let me print the written statement before edit rtn and this is rtn this is the after edit statement like going to browser and refresh the patch and once the refresh complete you can we will go to again in the uh, terminal side okay you can see here the name then after the total fees and active by default it's a chat i'm going to again pycharm and you can see here so this is the first time while we refresh the page you can see here this default underscore get method called with the all fields and before edit it was a blank dictionary and after like edit like after the edit dictionary you can see active true name is this one and total fees is 4000 so while return it will having this active name and total fees so like this way you can use this method if instead of using the default attribute you can also override default underscore get method and another point is like while you are using this method like which steps you have to follow let me show you this is my terminal and let me exist and re-enter right now you can call directly this method let me show you how self.env school underscore student and then after directly I have to use that method and pass the blank list and if I will do it you can see here like I'm getting this list of the default values 
but you can see here I didn't pass anything right now let me comment this method and try to exit and re-execute like login to again terminal and let me show you how it's work as a default oops school dot student and then after default underscore get and you can see here i didn't pass anything right now and once once i will click here so you can see here i'm getting a blank dictionary even if i'm adding here the default parameter like default equal to sunny leon then after default underscore sorry default equal to 200 and active equal to true so right now i used only default attribute and re-execute that default method we are calling from terminal side and in terms of your side you have to call this method via another uh, another custom method or existing any method you can call also like this way school underscore student and then after I'm using like default underscore get and I'm using here simple like a blank list and once I will enter you can see still I'm getting blank dictionary because here I didn't pass anything also this method is commented you can see here it should be com sorry uh, for that one you can see this default what we added here like that default and this default it should be com but in backend side it won't be com like this way because you have to mention here like which ma uh, like which field you have to get the default value if you have already uh, like already set default attribute in field level you can also add like total okay let me give you like what this example by mistakenly we added here as an active so it won't become only the name field will come so you can see here only name field return because active field don't have a default attribute and the name field have a default attribute that's why the this key and value pair return so let me give you one more example here like uh, let let me add one more field which don't have a default attribute you can see still it's coming like only name field with the sunny leone and this active and current and uh, currency underscore id didn't have a default value that's why in dictionary don't have that field name let me exist from here and uh, re-execute the script because i changed here default equal to true previously it was uh, active equal to true again i'm going to here like school dot student and using like default underscore get and uh, here i'm adding like name comma active then after comma and total underscore fees oops i mistake in models name so you can see here the name having this field uh, sorry name name field having a uh, sunny leone active is true total fees is 200 so it's coming from the default value but let me uncomment this method i will also add the another one like uh, yeah total fee sorry student fees and i'm adding here like 4000 let me exist from here because i changed and uh, here 
you can see right now we have override default method so you can see here there is a two scenario you can see now the first one is the i override the default get method and another scenario is default values self.env school.student and here i'm using default underscore get and providing blank list once i will press the enter key you can see here student fees 4000 return because we override inside this default underscore get method but it didn't appear the default attributes because we didn't add in list let me add one default attribute plus non default attribute like you can see a currency underscore id don't have a default attribute here and press enter you can see name having a this one and student fees 4000 so like this way it's working i hope you clear your doubt about default underscore get method and the default attribute if you have any doubts please comment below and see you in next session